But as promised, I have this audio. This is just amazing to me. If more people had done this in the very beginning of this pandemic, where would we be now? This is how a real man handles the COVID Nazis. Uh, Arthur Pulaski is the pastor of a church in Calgary, Alberta, Canada. Police officers showed up, interrupted his church service during Holy Week. And this is one of the best takedowns in the history uh, of the world. This is uh, Pastor Pulaski uh, telling the COVID cops to get lost. Please get out. Get out of this property. Immediately get out. Okay. Get out out of this property immediately out i don't want to hear anything out of this property immediately i don't want to hear a word out 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 of this property immediately until you come back with a warrant out 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 of this property immediately out immediately go out and don't come back don't, I don't want to talk to you. Okay. Not a word. Out of this pro out of this property. Immediately out. I don't care what you have to say. Out. Out. Out of this property, you Nazis. Out. Out. Gestapo is not allowed here. Immediately, Gestapo is not allowed. Out. Do you understand English? Get out of this property. Go. So go. Go. And don't come back without a warrant. Out, Nazi. Out. Out. You understand? Nazis are not welcome here. Out. And don't come back without a warrant. Do not come back without a warrant. You understand that? You're not welcome here. Nazis are not welcome here. All right, so it went on for about another 45 seconds or so, but you get the gist of it. This is a pastor that has experienced this before or has seen it or has been passed down uh, and uh, again through history uh, how all of a sudden they start disrupting church services we had the story last week about a, a pregnant mom that was arrested while in church because she wasn't wearing a mask she was in her catholic church she was arrested uh, and uh, you had the ushers uh, screaming you know arrest her get her out of here uh, again this is the mindset uh, this is the mindset of uh, the uh, of of the far left. Safe Retirement Solutions is there to help you with retirement questions and planning results. Build a better retirement. Call Rod Barrowi, president of Safe Retirement Solutions, today at four one zero two six six eleven twenty. That's four one zero two six six eleven twenty. Or on the web. And again, that includes Nazis and the, the woke Gestapo, if you will. But notice how they left. Notice how they left. They tried to get their piece in. They tried to get their statement in or whatever. But there were seven police officers in that video, seven of them. And every single one of them knew they were wrong because they left. They did not have a warrant. There was no reason for them to be there. Uh, had they knocked on the door and said, we got a complaint or whatever, and talked to the pastor? No, instead, uh, they storm in, and then they try to, uh, and he knew his rights. And you could, see, you could hear the passion in his voice. Can you imagine that the rest of us did that? If we acted like that, we wouldn't be in massive lockdowns. We wouldn't be under the thumb of the uh, Cuomos and the Wolfs and the Murphys and the Whitmers and the lockdown Larrys here in the state of Maryland. I heard Fauci over the weekend saying that your mask is a symbol. A symbol of what? A symbol of obedience. That's what it is. Uh, again, look, I'm all for practicing whatever protocols we can to get us through this, uh, this pandemic. But you don't quarantine the healthy. You quarantine the sick, and they've been completely out of control this entire year. Or now, what were the 360 uh, or 75th day or whatever it is to, to slow the spread, to flatten the curve so we wouldn't be overrun? That did not happen. And so we have the COVID cops and this pastor. God bless Pastor Pulaski uh, and uh, more people like him because that's uh, folks that know the right. This was in Canada, okay, of all places. Okay, but it's uh, Western Canada, so it's a little different than, uh, you know, Toronto, Montreal, and Ottawa, etc. Unbelievable. We're living in a takeover, total takeover of the government with their sags, guns, the brown shirts, the Gestapo wannabe dictators coming to the church 
with armed with guns and tasers and handcuffs to intimidate during Passover celebration? Well, I guess that's what it is. They want to enslave us all like the Egyptians did. They want to be pharaohs of today. That's what they're doing. Unbelievable. People, if you will not wake up, stand up. Wow, I, I don't know what is going to happen tomorrow. If Canadians will not rise up, look what is happening in Germany. Germany is taken over by fascism again.